Aloha, welcome to another Drupal tutorial for BYU Hawaii Webmasters. This tutorial will show you how to set up menus, configure menus, and move me menus around in, a, in your Drupal website. Menus are a critical part of a, a Drupal site. They can be located on the left sidebar or on the right sidebar, or such, such as an example of the sports uh, website, you can also have them as drop-down menus in a section called primary links on top here. Quickly going back to the webmasters page if we were to go to menus you will be able to see all the different menus that are that have been created on the webmasters uh, web page. For example you'll see the web uh, and design standards menu which is on the right sidebar and that's located up here and so pretty much this would be a quick administration uh, section where you can go to any menu that you want and you'll be able to edit the menu that you want and uh, for example here if I wanted to update the link for presentation standards I can go to this menu here and click edit and go and update the path or uh, the title the description I can also uh, control where I want that menu to be um, as far as its uh, location, whether it's the first item on the menu or on the second, and so forth. Going back to the to menu um, administration real quick, if I wanted general presentation to no longer be a sub menu under presentation standards and want it to be its own menu, I can either go here, do edit, and change the location of where I want this general presentation to be, or I can just drag it out of presentation standard and makes make it its own uh, main uh, menu uh, you can also uh, create a sub menu by just simply dragging the dragging the menu to the right and it becomes a sub uh, a sub menu within the menu that uh, it is located under uh, for example should there be a need that you want to disable a menu but do not want to delete it you can go to this option here and for example if I want to delete the presentation standard I mean uh, disable it I can just click there it will no longer be available for um, users uh, that are visiting your site to see another item that's critical is if I wanted to um, I'm gonna list all the menu back to the menu items if I wanted to edit for example the primary links the drop-down menu here uh, that's found on the sports page I can go again to menus and once again that portion right there is called the primary links I click on primary links and I will see all the uh, the items the the drop-down items um, on the menu here so what's critical is once you add a new item let's say we're gonna create a new uh, menu here for the primary links for the sports page I'm gonna create um, a new menu and I'm gonna say this is a test drop this is where you put the path and this is where you would put the menu title description is critical for um, screen readers and I'm gonna say it's gonna be a, a, a main primary item and once I create that and save it you'll be able to see the test drop-down menu there now if I wanted to create um, another drop-down item under test menu drop-down I'm just gonna go put the path for it for this example I'm just doing the BYU Hawaii link and I'm just gonna say sub test and one crit one thing that's critical is um, I'm just gonna there's two ways of doing it I can either go here and locate that new menu that I just created which is down here and say that I want it to be part of that menu or a sub menu and you can, that's one way of doing it but another easier way of doing it is 
just going back to the um, to the uh, administration page right here and just drag that and make it a sub menu and then another critical thing is you have to enable expanded so that I can have it be uh, displayed as a sub menu and a drop down once I'm done I create save configuration and I have the drop down menu and um, that's active on the, the the primary links menu that I've created that's pretty much a uh, basic configuration of um, of just primary links and your menu items. Another critical thing is if you want to create a, a new menu and place it under um, the primary links like for example if I was to go to the sports I um, mean the webmasters page here and I want a certification to be a drop down menu I'm just going to show you real quick how to do that I click on settings and I'm going to say I want a primary links and I want the source for primary links to be the certification now once I do that I'll have to I have saved that configuration and then I need to go to the themes go to configure and I need to have the primary links option available and click save configuration and now what I have done is I have made the certification be a drop down menu since there is no sub menu items once you create the submenu items, you will have the same drop-down menu as the primary links. Thanks.